some of the typical questions that customers will ask about the cube is, does my part fit? Is the accuracy applicable to what I'm trying to do? What kind of part can I fit in it? Is it the right weight? The, questions, the answers to those questions are, the accuracy of the system is about 78 microns. Uh, the part size, you can see if it fits through the garage door, it's about 3.1 meters in size. The weight of the part, it's a very uh, robust system, so it could fit about 3,000 pounds. Um, what are the safety mechanisms of the, of the system? You can see that we have the garage door, and if I bring the garage door down, get my hand stuck in the way, it will prevent me from bringing um, any parts or introducing any parts. If I'm inside the cell itself, and I press the garage door, it's obviously not going, not going to function. We have the four scanners preventing me from uh, coming into the cell and doing any kind of work while I am inside the cell. Now if I'm outside the cell, again, we have the normal emergency stops on the brake, on the teach pendant, and on the cube itself. Um, how long is it going to take me to program my parts? Um, depending on the part size, uh, depending on what kind of features you're trying to extract, it will vary. But parts like these, we, uh, as Jerome and I were talking, it took about an hour, hour and a half to program. And you know, once you do that one time, you can continue adding to the program to see uh, you need to add more features, extract different kinds of uh, uh, extract different kinds of measurements. But once you do it one time, that program is saved. You can uh, upgrade it, like, like I was talking about before. Um, and essentially, you can run that program 24 hours a day, seven days a week, or however long your shop is open. We have the, uh, the forks that we can use to introduce the parts to the, to the, the cell itself. Uh, typical forklift size uh, for the fork uh, separation. Cool things about the, the cell, it's a, it's a self-sufficient, uh, tool. It's, it's, you can incorporate, incorporate the automatic calibration. You can incorporate the automatic calibration for both the C-Track and the, uh, the MetroScan. So instead of having to manually calibrate like we have on, the, on our manual systems, you can incorporate the, the program into your, into your routines to calibrate every um, 15, 20 scans, every, every day, every hour, anything that you uh, want to customize to your, to your specific uh, tasks. The good thing about the productivity station like Jerome was talking about before is it will parallelize your, your operation. So as you're working, as a cell is working with one part, you'll be able to inspect that part dynamically and introduce a new part um, to uh, cut down your cycle time. The part that we, uh, we demonstrate over, uh, over and over again is the Chevelle. The Chevelle with the parallel scanning decreases our cycle time by about 20-25%, um, which over the course of a day, two weeks, a month, a year, it's, uh, it's a lot of manpower that we can, we can gain for production.